an ordinary night in an ordinary town, a small town in the middle of nowhere in particular. The children of Middleville, who have school in the morning, are getting a good night's sleep. Not a fantastic <laughs> night's sleep, <laughs> but a good night's sleep. Good night, son. Remember, if you're busy reaching for the sky, you'll fall flat on your feet. <laughs> Get some rest. Tomorrow is a school day and it's important to be rested. This is Julie Englander, weekend edition host for Iowa Public Radio. <laughs> Good night, dear. And remember, the things you can depend on might be the dullest things around. This is Ben Key, host of Iowa Public Radio's River to River. Good night, honey. Just remember, keep an even keel and a level course. Aim for the middle of the ocean. Or road if you're on land. <coughs> this is Charity Nebby from Middleville. substitute teacher for today. Schedule. Oh. 
That we have it, we'll be on our way. Thank <laughs> you. 
parlor, everyone's talking about their new hairstyles. And Middleville Manufacturing has begun custom building specialized parts. <laughs> At the library, Miss Plainly has ordered so many new books, mostly detective stories, but even some art history books. They're having to look for a new building. Some of the books she sends to the criminals. And one in particular she writes. <laughs> Specials are making waves all the way to Plainville. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Robot Criminals, Everett Ah, the gang of criminals. <coughs> They'll be disbanded when their boss takes a government job. Just <laughs> <laughs> hard to get. <laughs> expectations. That insight is contagious. Thank you.